So this is my uh, kind of review and overview of Samsung Pay, which I just got working on my Verizon Galaxy Note 5. Now, what's happening currently is that Verizon uh, has pushed out an update to support this, but they are forcing Samsung to release it on Google Play as opposed to the Samsung App Store, uh, Galaxy Apps. And um, so it's still not working, even though Verizon has said they'll support it and they pushed out an update. But what I discovered is if I sideloaded the APK, which you still have to do, it's still not listed uh, on the Verizon version of Galaxy Apps, um, it will, uh, well, previously it would let you uh, open the app and add a card, but it wouldn't let you actually uh, activate that card. Verizon was blocking that on their end. Um, but what I found out is now that Verizon pushed this quote-unquote update to allow Samsung Pay on uh, on Verizon, um, you can actually sideload the APK and it'll work. And so I just tried it out. I've been waiting a long time to do it. So basically, you can uh, swipe up from the lock screen. You can swipe up from the uh, from the screen off mode and from the home screen. Um, and it will basically turn on NFC and the MST technology and let you use it at a terminal. Um, I've only turned it on from the lock screen, but one thing I like is that you don't have to manually turn on NFC like you do with Android Pay. Um, and I just tested it out at a local grocery store. Worked like a charm. This thing is awesome. I'm going to use this everywhere and I'm going to carry my wallet around not so much. It worked on a Verifone terminal with no NFC support uh, like a charm. And it was pretty cool. And uh, again, if you want to, you can enable it to turn on from the screen off. So you just swipe up like that and it will appear. I don't have it on. And also from the home screen, I find that intrusive and I'm worried about battery life with the screen off. So I just enabled it on the lock screen. You swipe up, it verifies with your fingerprint and you can pay at supposedly any terminal uh, that has a, uh, uh, you know, an old magnetic strip slider in it. Um, and so far it's worked for me where it normally uh, wouldn't with Android Pay or with Apple Pay. Um, but I'm excited to have it working on Verizon. I've for so long wanted to have that happen and also just not carry a wallet around. So we'll see if it works like that, but uh, promising so far. There you go.